go. Once upon a time there was a mouse. He lived in a house in the country. That mouse packed his bag and went on a trip very, very far away, and we never saw him ever again. <laughs> so Tester moved in and made a few changes to his new place. My curtains, Tester's t- Tester's home sweet home. <laughs> But Mouse returned home. Oh yes, did I mention he brought back a big souvenir with teeth? A big dog. Back to the story. Once upon a time there was a mouse. He lived in... Sister, move out of the way. He lived in a house in the country (laughs) with his veterinarian dog. Only eight carrots. Then Melanie... I don't know that word. Begged. Begged. Chester to write a new, a br- brand new, a better, better story, and it goes something like this. Once upon a time, there was me, Chester Sanford, charming, handsome. What's that say? Envy. Envy of Mouse, smart, intelligent. Envy of Melanie, really handsome. Chester lived in Chester Vale, where no mice were allowed. It was a beautiful day <laughs> until it started to rain. <laughs> oh, that's that sturdy volley. Now, as I was saying, once upon a time there was a mouse. He lived in a house in the country, and he lived happily ever after. The end. I can't work like that! <laughs> Chester, that's enough. Hand over the... Chester, this is where I draw the line. Nope, I draw the line. Do not cross this line. Keep out, Chester aside. <laughs> He's like... <laughs> Chester, that's enough. Hand over that marker this instant. Chester is busy. busy. Ooh, look what I found. A loony just popped out of the book? Uh-huh. Hi, I'm Melanie Watts, and I'm very angry. Hello, I am boring, and I'm very jealous of this. Chester, that, I'm warning you. Hand over that marker and I apologize so before I, I can. Sh- go ahead and let Kara tell the story. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, twelve, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. La la la. <laughs> Chester, that all right, Chester. You want your own story. You want to be the star of this book. Well, get ready. Here it is. Finally. Once upon a time, there was a cat he was named Chester. He lived in a house in the country. Chester was a very handsome cat, especially when he wore the pink. You wouldn't. <laughs> two, two. Not personal. <laughs> that was a great story, Kiwi. I like that one. I can't find any money ever. Dear readers, I apologize for Chester's behavior in my mouse story. Sorry for the... Inconvenience. Inconvenience. That's a big word. Signed, Melanie Watt. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Look, this. Ow. I know. Oops, this thing. That's a funny book, Kiwi. I love it. <laughs> it's my favorite. And I might read Chester's back next time. I would love more Chester books. Yeah, there's a hundred more. <laughs> Back at the library. <laughs> they're written by... They're in W. Get all of them! Because her last name is Watts? Yeah. Nice. And Quinn, I'm only allowed to bring one book. I'm not allowed to bring all of them. But I'll bring the testers back and all of them. But one at a time, I'll have to go. What do you think of Chester? <laughs> Do you like Chester? 